So everything I was just talking about the last couple of days, just did a live on this yesterday. Just did a live on this yesterday. You know what I'm saying? We still talking about last. Man, the media is garbage, bro. I just put this information out yesterday. I'm glad Francis and Gunn who checked Tyson Fury to his face. Tyson Fury didn't say nothing. Didn't even stand up. Francis and Gunn said, without boxing rules, you're nothing to me. Snap my fingers, you're gone. I just said that. Francis and Gunn said, I snap my fingers with you, you're gone. The only thing that saved you was boxing rules. In the boxing ring. Outside the boxing ring, you're nothing. You wouldn't last five minutes with me. <laughs> Francis Ngannou had to let Tyson Fury realize, like, bro, you ain't, you're a boxer, but you're not a fighter. I'll throw you across the street. Hey, Francis Ngannou letting it be known, man. Letting it be known. And the media sitting around here, yeah, man, uh, so what about the fight with uh, Tyson and do you believe in yourself? And they asking dudes, do they believe in themselves? What? At the professional level, do I believe in myself? Man, one of the worst press conferences I've ever seen in my life. Uh, These guys don't know how to build up a fight, man, to be real with you. They try to protect images. Uh, They try to run with certain headlines right now. Francis Ngannou, check Tyson Fury. I don't. I don't know what Tyson Fury has been uh, thinking of lately. I don't know. I guess he thought Francis Ngannou was the type of guy who could would just sit back and take all kind of disrespect. But Tyson Fury's out of his mind, man. Talking crazy like he was. And then, bro, he need to check himself too. He he keeps making those weird statements about. Uh, uh, the the jail the jail loving statements he be making, the jailhouse uh love. So the jail loving, he be talking about the prison loving uh statements he be making. Tyson Fury need to relax on that, bro. I thought he was married. He need to chill on that. He throws that around too much. I thought he was married. He's doing too much of that. For real, for real. At this point now, bro, like every every other statement he's talking about is some dude on dude action. He needs to relax, man. Like for real. He's <laughs> and this the guy y'all running around for, man. Come on. Like Ingano said, man, you wanna last five minutes with me. Tyson Fury is a disgusting individual, man. And the people who support him and his fans, they're disgusting as well. He's sitting in the front row, acting like he's gonna intimidate somebody. Tyson, uh, and Gano said, I will wipe the uh, octagon with you. He meant the ring, but he said the octagon. You know, the English ain't good. I wipe the octagon with you. I will wipe it. I will wipe you with the octagon. All over the ground. Blood and everything. <laughs> man, and Gano letting it be known. These dudes are frauds, man. Tyson Fury, not on that type of level he should be got, uh, trying to go at a guy like Ngannou. I told people already, the media's going to ask stupid questions about his guys going to believe in, uh, uh, believe in themselves. If y'all don't think uh, Ngannou's for real, we're going to find out. And I'm glad. Yes, sir. Go time. It is what it is. I like this. I think this is right on schedule. People ain't talking about the fight now. They, they'll be talking about that this weekend. Because whatever the decision is going to be, it really doesn't matter on my part. I have no horse in the race. Anthony Joshua wins, good. Good for boxing. Ain't got no wins, good. Good for boxing. It's going to be entertainment. That's what y'all want. So at the end of the day, but I'm glad that Gunner was checking guys out there, letting it be known. Like, I already beat Tyson Fury. I'm going to beat him twice. That's what he said. I already beat you once, I'm gonna beat you twice. I beat you once and I'm gonna beat you twice already. That's what he said. Mmm, and guess what the media said? Nothing. 
And Gunner was talking facts, bro. And Gunner could really talk that he can really talk that talk, but he don't he ain't no talker. You know what I'm saying? He he grew up using his hands and feet. That's what he talked with. He really don't talk much. He's trying to learn how to talk. He usually just walks, runs, fights, punch. That's usually what he does. He doesn't do the talking thing. Man, these folks don't know what they got this show into. I can't wait till Friday. I hear people now talking about some, yeah, what about Friday? Yeah, all right, man. These dudes, man, they don't care about boxing, man. I hope a guy who does, uh, I guess right now they're talking about MMA versus boxing. I ain't know that it was an MMA versus boxing thing going on right now, but that's cool. I can get along with that. So who, what's going on? Is it Ganu versus somebody else, or what is the idea they got behind it? And Ganu versus somebody, or I don't understand. What is it? I mean, hopefully we'll find out eventually, but it's kind of crazy how things going on right now. Kind of crazy. That media day went exactly like I said, man. Yeah, I'm glad I'm I'm, I'm uh, reporting all this stuff. Just making history, tallying everything up. I've been doing same old, same old. But yeah, I'm glad Ngano spoke like he did. That's the most I've seen him like be aggressive and really. But when he heard that uh, Tyson Fury was making certain kind of comments as far as doing certain stuff to him, bro, he's he's like, bro. None of that disrespect because if I get up right now, ain't no boxing skills or techniques going to save you. Ain't no boxing rules going to save you. Out here, we ain't boxing. Ain't going to let him know that to his face just now. Checks Tyson Fury to his face. Out here, we're not boxing, buddy. Don't get beat down out here in front of everybody. For free. I already beat you before. I'm going to beat you again. I've already won. And nobody out there was saying, no, and Gunner, you didn't win. I told y'all. I told you. And Gunner said that in front of Fury and everybody. You know the only person who said something? Fury. He didn't say he didn't win, though. Expose these cats, man. It need to be done. He need to expose these guys. The boxing world is on Man, it's on thin ice right now. Everybody tells us we need Joshua to save boxing. No, I, I will. That conversation is going to be. I'm, I'm definitely going to address that. It's not boxing. It's a certain country's boxing, but it ain't, it ain't boxing as a whole. No sir. No, 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 nah. But that's all I got though. Like and subscribe.